I mixed acetone with coffee and surprised everyone with the result. You will be amazed by this product too. It's different from all the ones you've seen and used so far. To make this trick work, put four tablespoons of coffee in a bowl. Add about 100 milliliters of water and mix. The next ingredient you need for this trick is acetone. It is a product most commonly used to remove and dissolve many organic substances. Just two tablespoons of acetone are enough to remove various stains, dissolve burnt fats, and effortlessly eliminate different spots. The final ingredient in the mixture is dishwashing liquid. Use four tablespoons and mix everything well. Dishwashing liquid handles various kitchen stains perfectly. But in combination with coffee and acetone, it becomes even more effective. When all the ingredients come together, pour the prepared mixture into a spray bottle. This way, you can use it best and take advantage of its properties. The ingredients in this mixture, once combined and mixed, are ready for immediate use. Such a small amount is already sufficient to clean many pots and pans, or one pan, many times. Let me know if you also use coffee for cleaning in your home. This mixture will help you get rid of dirt and burnt residues from pans without scrubbing. You will be surprised at how quickly it dissolves grease layers compared to many other products designed for this purpose. It's different from all the ones you've used so far to remove stains and burnt residues. Just apply this mixture to the burnt pan and let it work. Light burn marks will disappear immediately. You won't even need a scrubbing brush. It will only come in handy for stronger burn marks. You can also use this mixture on various other stubborn kitchen stains on metal surfaces and aluminum pots. Just remember not to clean plastic surfaces with a mixture containing acetone. Behind the oven door, there is a hidden button that makes cleaning easier. Most people are unaware of it. Just pull it upwards to release the lock. Repeat the process on the other side. With the doors prepared in this way, they will be easy to remove. Next, grab them and lift them slightly. The hinges should come out on their own. There is a protective plastic on the oven door. Use a screwdriver to pry it open and then remove it. This way, you'll be able to disassemble and clean the glass. Not everyone knows that you can also remove the rack and glass when cleaning. Just pull them towards you with a firm motion. This way, you can thoroughly clean the oven walls. If you don't like scrubbing off burnt grease and food residues, use baking soda. It has excellent cleaning properties and is safe for health. Sprinkle it evenly over the doors and inside the oven using a sieve. A thick layer should cover the entire surface. Then, take a paper towel. Spread it in the areas covered with baking soda. Pour a cup of vinegar into a spray bottle. Screw it tightly. Spray the towels generously with it. They should absorb the mixture well. Both substances will react under the towels and start removing burnt food. Leave it all for 15 minutes. After that time, simply remove the towels and wipe the oven with them. All the dirt will stick to their surface, and you won't have to scrub. It can even handle tough stains. Pour this foaming mixture into the toilet and see what happens. This trick is used by housekeepers in five-star hotels. Thanks to it, you can clean even a heavily soiled toilet literally without scrubbing. The bubbling foam will do all the work for you. Pour five tablespoons of laundry detergent into a bowl. Then add five tablespoons of salt. It has disinfectant and strong cleaning properties. Due to its properties, salt can successfully replace harmful chemicals in many situations. Add 50 milliliters of vinegar to the powder. It excellently eliminates bacteria, germs, and mold. It can even tackle very old deposits of lime scale that often accumulate under the rim of the toilet bowl. Mix everything together. The mixture will start reacting and foaming immediately. This combination of ingredients acts like an invisible brush. Just pour it into the toilet. It's worth pouring it on the walls as well. Then leave it for several minutes. The active foam will dissolve water deposits and disinfect the inside of the toilet. The bathroom will be filled with a fresh, clean scent in just a few minutes. I pour this powder into the toilet and leave it overnight. In the morning, it's like new without scrubbing. This trick will work for busy people's homes. 
When lime scale, dirt, or an unpleasant odor starts to appear in the toilet, you can wash it off without wasting time on cleaning. It turns out that all you need to do is toss a handful of laundry detergent powder into the toilet bowl. Be sure to spread it evenly along the walls. Leave it overnight. In the morning, use a brush to clean the interior of the toilet and flush the water. The powder has water softening, cleaning, and disinfecting properties. This simple trick leaves the toilet snow white, and you won't even have to lift a finger. Drop this ball into the toilet. It will smell fresh without cleaning. This trick works great when you have unexpected guests. The toilet will be clean and fragrant, and you won't even lift a finger. These balls are my secret patent for a quick bathroom refresh. Preparing them is childishly simple. I pour a cup of baking soda and half a cup of citric acid into a bowl. Then, I add about ten drops of my favorite essential oil. I mix everything and add a little water. I stir until I get a sticky consistency. I shape them into balls using an ice mold or my hands. I leave them to dry overnight. The balls can be stored for a few weeks. I throw them into the toilet when lime scale or bad odors start to appear. The natural ingredients activate when they come into contact with water from the bowl, creating a disinfecting foam. Baking soda has properties that remove lime scale and disinfect. The essential oil leaves a beautiful fragrance in the bathroom. After a few minutes, I scrub the inside of the toilet with a brush and flush. These balls are a reliable trick for unexpected guests. Just drop one into the toilet to refresh it quickly. A well-placed roll under the board is a sign for someone who wants to use the restroom. Pay attention to it before you sit down. It's a discreet way to convey important information. It will save trouble for the next person who wants to use it. If you notice that the toilet paper has run out, take an empty roll and place it vertically under the board. This will indicate that there is no more paper in this restroom. The next person in line will quickly notice that something is wrong. They can choose another stall or get a new roll of paper. Burn the paper roll above the toilet. You will thank me for this trick. You will never throw away a roll of used toilet paper again. This clever recycling trick will come in handy for everyone. Often when using the toilet, there is an unpleasant smell in the bathroom. A simple roller trick will do the trick. Just set it on fire above the toilet. When it starts to burn, hold it for a few seconds and extinguish it. The flame absorbs the bad smell from the bathroom. Hold the blanking roll over the toilet. You will quickly notice that the smell of smoke will disappear without leaving a bad smell behind. One roll can be used many times in this way. It's an ecological and effective trick. I no longer use corrosive and chemical drain cleaners. This natural alternative is cost-effective and safe. It clears the pipes and eliminates unpleasant odors. Is your shower drain not draining water properly? It's often due to the accumulation of soap scum, hair, and detergent residues clogging the pipes. This simple recipe for a drain snake will solve this problem in just five minutes. Pour four tablespoons of baking soda into the drain, and then pour vinegar over it. These substances will react, creating a foam that will flow down the pipes. Baking soda has cleaning and disinfecting properties. The foaming action will fill the pipes and push out trapped hair and grime. Vinegar removes mineral buildup, unpleasant smells, and, thanks to its acidic nature, effectively tackles dirt. Just rinse everything with water and you're done. The drain will be clean and fresh-smelling. You can apply the same trick to your kitchen sink. Greasy food residues often accumulate in its pipes, leading to unpleasant odors. Baking soda and vinegar will effectively unclog and clean the inner parts. Your sink will be unobstructed and fragrant. There will be no need for using chemical products.